don't ski, Lady T. She not here. She at work. And um, today I will be making ribs. Check this out. We have one, two, three slabs of St. Louis style pork spare ribs. Mm -mm -mm. This is gonna be good. Um, I'm gonna cut them open, wash them off, and season them with famous Dave rib rub. Famous Dave, they make really good barbecue, and their season is good too. Look at Dave. What up, Dave? That's my boy right there. Um, yeah, it's all good. Look at that. It goes great on pork chops too. But yeah, you pick this up at Smith's or you know your grocery stores out here in Vegas. It's pretty pretty good, like I said. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna wash them up and season them up and get them ready, and then we're gonna put them in the smoker. Let's go. Okay, I have a tip for everybody. <clears throat> you see this right here? This is a membrane. And a lot of people pull that off. I pull it off myself. This is what it looks like when the membrane is off. It's just basically just, you know, skin. And you just grab it on a little corner and you just peel it off. Just peel it off. It might take you a little bit to get it off because it's really on there really good. And, um... Yeah, but you want it to look like this, so when you season it, that season sinks into the meat on both sides. You know what I'm saying? And also, if you're smoking it, 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 it helps. I'm telling you, that helps out a lot. All right, let me get back to it. All right, here's how I season my ribs. I take mustard, mustard, and rub it all over my ribs on both sides, and then I begin the seasoning because the mustard not only does it give it a little flavor, it also helps the um, seasoning stick to it. So I always sprinkle up high and then I go for it like this. Look at that. And I always season heavy. I love Famous Dave's because it does not have a lot of salt. Oh, well, you can't taste it when you're eating it because I don't like salty ribs. I think that's the grossest thing somebody could ever do is over salt the ribs. I'd rather just have garlic powder and onion powder, paprika, brown sugar, and all that, than to have somebody over salt the ribs. Look at that. That's dope. Look at that. You can see the seasoning and all the mustard. Looking good. Looking good. All right. So, let me get them all together. I'll be right back. All the ribs are in the smoker. Um, it's warming up. Let me show you real quick. All right, I got my Bass Pro smoker. My master built. You can't really find these no more. <laughs> but, I mean, Bass Pro Shop, they have, you know, the newer version. But check this out. So let me pop this. Pop the little latch. Open it up. And look at that. The ribs. Absorbing all that smoke flavor. I got three ribs plus all the little trimmings that I took off. Oh, it smells good. Oh, yeah. But we'll be back in a couple hours. You know, I'm going to keep loading wood chips in there and get it ready. And I'll let you see the finished product. Hey, you ready, duty? Open it up. Oh, look at the smoke. Oh, not a smoke, huh? Let's see. What you got? What you got? You got ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. oh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that! They're basically done. When you start seeing the bone hang out like that, oh man, got my drip tray down there. I put water and apple juice in there just to keep the meat moist. Oh man, let me take it. Still a little piece. Let me still a little piece. Come on, close it up, dude. Ooh, look at that. This is a piece that I cut off the rib. Look at that. Look at that color. And I know a lot of people like meat with burnt ends. This right here is to die for. Now you want a piece? Yeah. Hold on, let's eat. Huh. It might be a little warm. Huh, grab a piece. Grab it. Grab it. Pull it. We're gonna break it. <laughs> Try it. What you think? Yeah. It's good. I like it too. Mm-hmm. 
Ooh, the flavor on here is really good. Mmm. Give it a thumbs up. That's right. Good, good, good. Next, we're going to take my cut them. Look at that. Big difference from earlier, huh? Look at that. Look at that. Nice and seasoned. Nice and even. Huh, Lady T? Why she come over trying to eat them? Like my son over there trying to get some meat. What you doing? Oh, man. But yeah, I'm about to cut them up. Let's go. All right, y'all. Here we go. The ribs are all cut up. I got my little sides, my little green beans, and a little bit of macaroni and cheese. And look at that. Look at that. Nice and neat. Here are the rest of the ribs right here. Look. They're all cut up restaurant style. Shit. I'm about to dig in. All right, y'all. Well, thank you for tuning in to Juicy and Lady T. I uh, hope you enjoyed that because I know I'm about to get ready to enjoy these ribs. Here go Lady T right here. She finally made it home. Hello, okay. my baby. <laughs> Stop twerking. <laughs> I twerk yeah. for them ribs. Oh, man. Shit, I'm going to give you two. You better give me more than that. Okay. You want me to act right? Act up, you're gonna get snatched hey. up. Black Beauty, she's still in your song. No, honey, I'm just repping. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. All right, y'all. Well, tune in next time to Chunsky and Lady T. Peace. Peace.